how are you enjoying LA? I'm absolutely loving it here. I came for two weeks um, with a girlfriend for a bit of a holiday and then um, my flight was on Thursday and I, um, I kind of watched it go past in the sky. So I don't have a flight home at the moment, which is really fun. No, I've missed it and I want to stay forever. <laughs> So what have you done since you've been here? Um, we started off with a holiday, so it was sort of a week with a girlfriend. We did all the parties in the Coachella and oh. dressed as cowboys around the desert and I had a lot of fun. Um, and then she went home and I've had meetings ever since and they've gone really well. So, I, I mean, I love it here and um, yeah, just just been in hotels but about to move into an apartment. So really, really love it here. Oh, so you really are staying? I, yeah, I'm a London girl through and through, but I'm going to stay for a little bit. Like the weather here is so good and the people are so friendly here. Like everyone's so nice. I made so many friends, so I definitely want to stay a bit longer. Right. So what are you missing though about London? Are you missing anything yet? Food. Oh. I know that I'm a big foodie and, um, and I love cheeseburgers, but there's only so many cheeseburgers that you can eat. So yeah, the food, definitely. I, I mean, I love our like, but then again, I think London's home and I know all the like little nooks and places that I love. Yeah. But here I'm like driving around like, where do I go? So you're going to have to give me some tips on like best restaurants and things like that. Yeah, I just moved here too. So you have the same experience. Yeah. Like, <laughs> but how's driving here since... It's totally different than in London. I have got myself in so much trouble driving. You can't do U-turns. No, you can't do U-turns on the phone, but don't tell anyone that either. No. I managed to do a U-turn on the phone. Not that I was on the phone. I was not on the phone to my mum. Um, and um, there's no one around apart from one car stops. And it's um, it's a Jeep in the roof stand. And there's this girl waving her hands like, what are you doing? And shouting at me. I look up and it's Lindsay Lohan. Shut up. Yeah, I was literally like, "Mum, Lindsay Lohan shouting at me." Okay, well, <laughs> it was a, it was a good moment. It was really funny. It. A lot of people don't shout like that. I don't think it was fabulous. But I probably shouldn't have been doing a U turn on the wrong side of the road. But we're in America. Sorry. <laughs> That's really cool. So tell us about your swimwear line. I um I launched my first swimwear collection a year ago, which is called Kimberly London, um, and it is uh, British based. So everything's made in England, and everything's from Italy, and the gold is real gold from Paris and they're really like luxurious pieces and they're I have to say they're beautiful because I love them um, and I design them all myself and model them myself and um, I launched a collection a month ago and it's doing really well so I'm a happy girl and I've got another one coming out in a, in a month or so so I'm going to go back to England and do all that but they're really beautiful and they're really elegant sexy and check them out. Right. Can you tell us like what kind of style this one is and then what's going to come up next? The one that launched a month ago was really sexy. It was sort of kind of pushing the boundaries. It was a little bit bondagey, a little bit risque, a little bit like they're all cut on the Brazilian side. So they're really sexy and little, which is amazing. It makes girls' bodies look fantastic, um, which I guess is the aim of all swimming costumes is to make you feel beautiful. Yeah. So I, I love this collection. It's sexy. It's more grown up than the last. And the one coming out in summer is like sailory. So it's all nautical stripes, high-waisted. 1920s sort of pin-up girl themes so we had a lot of fun shooting it and um, and some really silly moments as well so I can't wait to show you all. <laughs> That's cool and you're the model for them too? Yeah which is really scary like it's the scariest thing in the whole I mean it kind of makes sense to do it that way but it's really really scary so it's fine. <laughs> right. So how do you stay in shape to model? Them? I remember the first the first collection I was really nervous and I and I did the whole dieting thing and like really worried about my body and then this collection, I actually was a stone heavier than I was last collection, which is actually quite a lot of weight. So, um, and I didn't worry about it, I didn't diet, and I kind of thought, I'm modeling for real girls, so I'd rather just be exactly as I am and not starve myself and eat what I want and be like, this is how I am, like, I do have a boobs and a butt, but I'm, I don't mind, like, let's keep it that way. I'm gonna have cake if I want it. So, yeah, I kind of wanted to encourage girls to be comfortable in their own skin and not, like, crash diet just for a photo shoot, so. Yeah, that's really inspiring. That's good. Yeah, because real people, we aren't that yeah. skinny. So I just thought, yeah, let's, let's not worry about it. And like, girls are girls, and I think curves look better yeah. in bikinis. So I thought, that's why so not? Cool. I can't wait to see them. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to see them. I think you'll love them. Yes. So since you're here, are you going to maybe do like a reality show here, or are you done with that? Um, I would definitely do something over in America. Definitely. Um, yeah, definitely. I mean, there have been talks about it for years, and um, coming over here, I love. America, absolutely adore it. Um, but I am British through and through, so I definitely have to keep it with the London roots. Yeah. yeah. That's so cool. So, who do you like admire, like as a reality star here in America? I don't know. I don't know who I admire. No, I don't know. I think um, 
I think I don't want to be just a reality star. I'd like to go more down the branding route um, and down the sort of style route more than um, just reality. But I mean, reality is great. We love it. It's so entertaining. It's so great to see into people's lives. Um, I just launched a blog, um, which is so on me. I'm rubbish. At, I can't spell at all. So when you read it, you'll be like, Kimberly, the amount of comments. That, uh, I mean, I get people tweeting me being like, that's not a real word. So I get my mum even calling up being like, Kimberly, that's not a real word either. I'm like, oh, well. Um, but I can't spell, which I think is kind of the charm of it. Um, and it's just like pictures. It's a lifestyle blog. So it's just like like behind the scenes of someone's life and it's fun and young and yeah. So what is the blog? Like what's the name? It's called Kimberly London, so it's all part of the website. Um, and it's just like places I love to eat, clothes that I love. It's just it's just fun and young and it's a really good way to like if you're in a new place to see new things and stuff like that. Yeah, that's a really good idea. I can't wait to check it out. It's windy here. We're gonna probably get hit so who are you dating? Anyone right now? No, I'm single at the moment. Single. Yes, I'm single at the moment. Um, I um, yeah, and so it would be up for meeting a, a nice American boy. <laughs> Say, what type of guys do you like? Um, I like the all American Californian boy with the blonde, like messy hair and the, and the you know the surfer boy. I like that. My mom keeps telling me to grow up that it's um, that I should not like that sort of boy, but I do, and they're always trouble. So but you I do. Like the American because girls here, I mean, I like an English accent. So you like American yeah. accent? Um, guys. I like an Australian accent. Like, yeah. makes me go weak at the knees. Yeah. Like, absolutely love it. Um, or I quite like a southern boy accent, like from Texas or like, yeah, where they listen to country music and things like that. I like that a lot. Um, but I do love the Australian accent as well. Yeah. <laughs> well, hopefully you'll find a good American boy here for you. And maybe you'll do a reality show and... I can't wait to check out your blog and your swimwear line. Oh, so nice to meet you. Thank you so thank much you. for talking to us. Oh, thank you. Bye. Bye. Doing some more um, pictures.